So I'm working on the quad turbo again today. I uh, went out to the shed and got the uh, driver's side manifolds and the water pump off the motor on the dyno. As you can see, I've already started using the car as a workbench. But the main reason I quit messing with the thing was uh, oil scavenging. I couldn't get the oil out of the lower turbos. So my previous attempt was with this little power steering pump that I got out of the junkyard for 15 bucks. It's a rotary vane. It's great for making pressure, but this one doesn't do so well at vacuum. Um, I could drive the car, I don't know, half mile or so, and then it would just start pumping oil out of the exhaust. So, what I have is this Barnes two-stage external gear pump. Uh, by their design, it should be able to uh, be self-priming and have some lift to it, so it should be able to vertically it will pull the oil up vertically. So before I do anything, I'm going to test it. But uh, the intention is to mount it on here. And uh, to do that, I need to put the other stuff back on here, the alternator and um, manifolds and whatnot. So I decided rather than uh, guess whether or not they were making vacuum, I could actually just measure it. I'm up here at my flow bench. I've got a couple of uh, absolute referenced capacitance manometers. And so I have one of the stages hooked to it, and we can see what kind of vacuum it pulls. So right now we're sitting at a 743.9 tor. And I'm turning it backwards. I'm try forwards. So we went down to like 640 tor, and it's climbing, even though it's running. And I'm guessing that's because I'm slinging the oil out of it and the oil that was in it is helping it seal. So I imagine that when this has oil in it, the vacuum should go up significantly. So I'm gonna hook this other one up and I'd expect it to be lower vacuum or higher pressure. So we're at 743.9. And see it's just climbing. So it went to 680 tor, which is still pretty decent. Let's test my theory. I just put some oil in here. This is the side that was pulling it down to 680 tor. Try not to blow the oil everywhere. There we go. Oh yeah. So it dipped down to 40 or 400 tor. So almost half atmosphere. For a simpler test, I can just do this in inches of water. like about 34. <laughs> so I got the manifolds uh, mocked up on there. I had to uh, pull the radiator out to uh, get the damper insulation tool in there. And I have the damper most of the way on. The water pump still needs to go on and the alternator before I can uh, figure out how I'm going to mock up the pump, but that's enough for tonight. So I thought I'd leave you with the view out the windshield with the top down. <laughs>